What's going on guys? It's David here. Welcome to another devotional Saturday. So I am up at the town little center and uh, looks like they're preparing for Christmas as you can see behind me a little green. They'll have a red one too. And then also there's a corn maze behind the camera. They're making for like I think a fall fest uh, trick-or-treating thing or something going on here. But the leaves are turning awesome beautiful colors. The sun is shining. Beautiful day. But with the beautiful day uh, comes trials. And as I've told you before, as my friend has always said, we're either in a storm, we're either going into a storm, in a storm, or coming out of a storm. It's kind of how I feel right, right now uh, with everything going on. It's just been a busy time. Fall is usually busy for me. It's moving more busy. Uh, I am uh, taking my mom to Columbus for the Horse Congress again. And then there is the Circleville Pumpkin Fest. So if you're watching this, as this is published, uh, I will be at Circleville. Um, we will be doing an outreach, open air preaching, passing off gospel tracts, engaging in conversation. And uh, my friend Joshua, and he's got a crew that he put together, have been down there already for a few days now preaching. So I ask for your continued prayers for that. It would be great. So we thank you for that. And then also, just with that busyness, there's also um, my cat has been sick, which is always difficult uh, if you're an animal lover very difficult um, especially now he's not eaten and it's just going from there so it's like what do we do I've been praying to the Lord just to give me some more time with them but you know, I've been reading the scripture and you know it may not happen uh, you know and uh, I just know he keeps telling me to trust him so I'm gonna continue to trust him and also about worrying about tomorrow uh, we shouldn't worry about tomorrow whatever's gonna happen is gonna happen it's got enough problems of its own as Jesus says uh, so just think about today what are we gonna do today um, so I really don't have a devotional for you except for that. And then also when we go down there, I just thought um, it's interesting to be using some gospel tracks. I got some four different ones I thought were pretty cool. Um, you can see here, there's like this trick-or-treating one, a little headless horseman, skater, talks about death, and also this guy coming out of here. Frankenstein or something. Uh, and they all have the gospel message on it. Uh, so we will be passing out those. I got 1,600 of those. My dad helped me put a bunch of these together. I uh, don't take a pack and just pass out them. I organize them. So every fourth one, you know, every one gets some. So there are four people. They get four different ones. Uh, so it's really cool. Um, and so just continue to pray for that, that uh, hearts will be opened, uh, eyes will be opened to the Lord, that we will speak and be from the Lord and not of ourselves, because a lot of times we want to work our own strength, which we can't. Everything comes from the Lord. Um, you know, our every heartbeat, our every breath that we take, you know, we, our sight, everything is from Him. So that's what I want you guys to think about as you go about your week. Again, I continue, uh, please pray for us that this outreach will uh, uh, just uh, be pleasing and glorifying to the Lord. I think. Joshua said, and I've seen it before, about 400,000 people out of the course of four days are there. So it'll be interesting. Um, so that's what I got for you today. Again, can't worry about tomorrow, no matter what's going on. Continue to keep our focus on the Lord and his kingdom. Uh, I know at times it gets difficult for me. Uh, getting the scripture it is reassuring um, and refreshing. Uh, but, you know, whatever's going to happen is going to happen. So that's what I got for you guys today. Uh, Till next time, I will give you an update uh, on Circleville, and we'll go from there. All right. And, uh, oh, let me know. Comment below. I want to know about outreaches that you've done. Uh, let me know what you've done, passing out tracks, you know, what you like to use. Because eventually I want to start doing some more maybe shorts uh, for gospel tracks and give you some tips and things that I've learned along the way. Uh, had that uh, uh, witch's walk, uh, which was interesting. And uh, I don't know if I did a video on that. I don't think so. But it was interesting. It was very, 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 very interesting. Uh, and just things that we learned. Um, so, yeah, that's what I got for you today. I'm just rambling because just not thinking clearly. <laughs> but uh, all right, guys. So I'm going to renew my mind uh, in the Lord uh, and glow myself with the Lord. And I'm going to go for a walk and enjoy the rest of this day. All right. I love you guys. Till next time. Peace. I'm out.